Police believe they found the getaway car used in one of Melbourne's most notorious gangland killings. They've also offered a $100,000 reward for information, hoping to break the decade-long mystery. Rory McLaren has more. Seized from Alexandra near Lake Yildon, investigators say this car may lead to the killer of a gangland linchpin. This vehicle um, is uh, linked to the death of Graham Kinneborough. Known as the Munster, Kinneborough was gunned down in December 2003 at the height of the gangland wars. Witnesses that night saw a dark Hyundai XL fleeing the scene. The 62-year-old was an associate of the Moran crime family. Four months later, police believe the car was also involved in the disappearance of Terence Blewett, an armed robber with links to rival underworld figure Carl Williams. We certainly believe that um, Terence Blewett has died. He's either been murdered or he's died as a result of an accident. And we believe whatever occurred, occurred in that vehicle. Williams was always a suspect in Kinneborough's murder, but others are also being investigated over Blewett's disappearance, including the car's then owner. They haven't been helpful in terms of the investigation and as a result there's still a person of interest in that inquiry. New information came to light as police re-examined 17 gangland investigations for the coroner. Police forensic experts will now systematically go over every centimetre of the vehicle as they look to find the DNA evidence to help close these two cases for good. If someone has uh, um, bled in that car, for example, there's trace DNA, we're pretty confident we can pick it up even 10 years after the fact. A $100,000 reward has also been offered. The current owner of the car is not under investigation. Rory McLaren, 10 News.